I have to explain why everybody's in trouble, basically. So I'll try and do it. Now, there was the Big Bang a long time ago. Whenever it happened. Yep, we're using that as a dynamic. So there was a Big Bang. And it's put... Well, the universe is expanding, isn't it? So there used to be tiny. So there was a Big Bang, right? And it shot everything. It was a singularity. Everything was in that one bit. Let's call it a bit. It was in one bit. And it exploded somehow. And it had peripherals. It had uh, quotients. It had energetic... It had an energetic force that has pushed everything out to where everything lies today. So we can say that to that degree that that was... This is my fundamental thinking. Fuck. So get the fuck away! Because I said so. If he's cracking his shits, then fuck off. Because he runs true. Fuck off. Don't interrupt, please. Go the fuck away. A hundred meters. One hundred meters, please. Get the fuck out. He's not talking. Don't talk, Warwick. Because they can get the fuck out. He's not talking. Well, you pause this, so fuck you. Yeah, well... Oh, fuck. And it's got to do... Well, now I don't know what to say. Well, we missed all of that, didn't we? Oh, well. I'm pissed off. Because. Where's my money? So. The Big Bang. And it put everything where it is. Right? And everything is in its place. That couldn't be changed. Because they're all inanimate objects just flying through the... And they've probably got spirits in them, yeah. Because everything's conscious. So everything's got its grouping. So in that group, there's going to be some sort of spirits in it. Because everything's conscious. Everything's just a set configure of elements. Everything's just elements. Hydrogen, helium, lithium, beryllium, boron, carbon, nitrogen, oxygen. Off you go. That's all I know. Off you go, that's all just a set configuration of elements. So where do you draw the line as to where it's got consciousness or not? So even each element on its own is conscious to a degree. So it has, to a degree, us in it, if you like. Yes. Spirits. Our long frequency, which is, which is our self that's been living essentially, well, since the the Big Bang, I guess, but it says eternity, but but it's eternal and that's another thing. And then, so it's put everything where it is. The Earth is exactly where it is. So imagine then if you change the peripherals, the quotient of energy of the Big Bang and everything was done slightly to an angle of even point oh 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 off to a million zeros and then one. Right, and then over this, how old is um, how old is it's thirteen billion years old or whatever, and the Earth's four billion years old. So then I guess the Sun is. Hey Google, how old is the Sun? It must be five or six. The age of the Sun is four billion six hundred and three million years. Well, I don't believe that four billion six hundred four billion because the Earth is supposedly that age. So how could they come almost the same? So that's that's got to be wrong. That the sun is four billion something years old and the earth is, is fucking four, 4.3 or something. So that's got to be wrong, you dickheads. Well, see, this is the problem. There's no consensus of the information and there should be, but there's not. And that's half the problem where dickheads come along and fucked it. The devil... The black, the black, black holes, whatever. Black people, I don't know, maybe that's the thing. Maybe it's, maybe it's a marker, they're black for a reason. Not saying they should be treated like shit, because they shouldn't, they're still people, right? Yes, exactly. Because that's my thinking, that's how I think. 
those voices are just, we're just fucking, we're part of him. And what he knows deep down, we can project and we add too. Yeah, we do. So there you go. And then everything's just put there in a spot. And if it was changed by that degree that I said, by that tiny little bit, right, then um, over the four, uh, half a billion years when everything's been put to where it is now, it wouldn't be where it is. It'd be, it wouldn't exist or it would be off some degrees or it most likely wouldn't exist. The earth wouldn't be where it is, right? Um, <clears throat> Things would totally be different. The, all the things that have happened couldn't have happened. And so therefore, therefore, we can say to a strong degree, the Big Bang has to do with exactly what is going on right now. You bringing your <clears throat> cup of tea to your mouth. But then what happens is life happens. Okay. And life essentially well, it's, it looks like we have free choice, but we have much less free choice than we think we have. Why? Because we're also making decisions that affect outcomes out there because we're sort of all playing a game here. It's a good and evil game and everybody's in it. And sometimes we all add things to the evil side and sometimes we add things to the good side, but people are also born and are overall evil or overall good. And that's sort of off the track. But so the earth has been put where it's been put and that had to happen. And everything else in the universe is exactly where it is. Because, yeah, and that's my other theory that we're, when we're born, a star is born as well. It's either, it's either, it's either, it's off the topic. It's new. That's very new. It's either we have a star like for our long frequency, like it was like that, like the star, and then we're born again and again in different lives, or every life we have, we a star is generated. Yeah, and it fits the cycle, and it, that's how the universe expands. When more life is created, then the universe gets more stars so it has to expand and it goes on like that it's compounded it's compound interest and so everything's been put where it is so then we were and we were all going to be born that was going to happen that just was going to happen everybody who's born their bodies was it was just going to happen that's all you can say there's it's hard to this one to put into words like just everything was it was all just going to sort of happen this way. So, if it was going to happen, yeah, well, we're not getting into if it was going to happen this way, then, then it's okay and it's all fine and fuck Warwick and he's, he's you assholes. No, you're not going down that line. Because it's not. Because you had choices. This is where he's getting to, you fucks. He hasn't finished yet. Let the boy finish first. Yeah, you keep interrupting him. Everybody. So leave him alone to be unfettered. That's been the word of the day and the week and the whatever. Right. And so we make decisions. We think quantumly. We make decisions in the now to affect the outcomes that happen out there to other people. And it's all just a, a tussle of this. So to a large degree, we think we've got free choice, but we've got even less free choice because of that. So the free choice is squashed down. And I'm almost saying that we basically have no free choice. And only sometimes, sometimes we can make another decision, but maybe only one person can, or maybe only some people can make true, true decisions that are, that are going to change the future. Otherwise, it's more or less just happening as it's going to happen and we can't change it. Yeah, and so what comes out of him, me, yes, Warwick, yes, what comes out of him is the truth, <laughs> and you're all screwed. But that's for another thing. I'm going at 10-10. It's just the way the Big Bang works, and the Big Bang timeline is the key, people. You remember the Big Bang timeline. 
Regardless, the Big Bang timeline has been changed, right? So, no, we're going longer to 11.11, hopefully. The Big Bang timeline has been changed, right? So it's all supposed to go down the way it's supposed to go down. And there's decisions are being made. <clears throat> and even one little decision goes to the evil side or it changes things to that like wokeisms and the trans movement and this like it's just that's sickening and cutting children up letting them cut themselves up when they're young it's sickening right that stuff is the evil it's the black it's it's the black yeah and it's the devil shit that's the shit that doesn't want us to have children and and wants us to not live it it, it just doesn't want life this thing this thing, yeah, this entity, it just don't want life, and it's in us, right, and it's taken over a bit, it, the negative has taken over, and the deep state and all that is connected, I'm going at a level level, deep state is connected and all that, and they have got control, and they shouldn't, they got money, and they, are, that's the only reason why they have power, not because they're clever, because they're fuck faces, <laughs>